What do you thought about the performance of the rookies? Okay, yeah, this is a very interesting, very interesting topic to talk about. Let's talk about how... Let's talk about Gonzalez and let's talk about Soto. I don't even know how these guys are rookies, all right, guys? Let's, let's be completely... Let's, okay, I'll be completely honest, guys. These guys are insane. There's no other way to say it. There's no, there, there's no way to sugarcoat it. I'm honestly just speechless. Whenever I talk about Gonzalez, whenever I mention Soto, it's just so fucking weird because they're so good, but they have no experience internationally, right? Usually when you talk about young players, or they're not young. Well, if we're talking about young, Ohem and Edward are younger, but when you talk about new players who don't really have competitive experience like competitive means like mpl right mpl experience you tend to get i don't know how to say this your mental isn't as strong you know mentality is a big part of the game uh in esports in every sport to be honest and gonzalez and soro they it's just fucking ah yeah mentality was not a problem whatsoever for them it was a big concern for me i've heard that was a, it was a concern as well from bon chan how are they going to perform on stage in a different country playing for the philippines and man oh man they are fucking crazy but in my personal opinion yes gonzalez he's grazing he's amazing soto same thing he's fucking amazing but but it's all thanks to Venus. Venus might me might be currently the best or the smartest, the greatest mind that we have in Mobile Legends Bang Bang. I'm gonna have to say it because it's true. Currently, the positioning, the way they play fights, the way they rotate on the map, the way they they do anything in the game has been phenomenal. And one of the big concerns that I had when I made the prediction that Indonesia will get gold was that. How was Venus going to perform? How was he going to shout call in the Sea Games when he's not really that active in MPL, right? Because um, obviously they took a break from MPL. I said that, I said again in my prediction video that there was going to be two outcomes. There could be a negative one and a positive one. Negative one is that maybe Venus's shot calls get dull and maybe her mechanics as well. And that might just screw up this team. Or it could be actually a positive that they took a break because with the break, they won't be burnt out. They get a lot of information just from watching these games happen from RRQ, from Onyx in MPL ID, and they can use this to create a game plan of their own, which I feel like they did. And yeah, uh, come on, they they're fucking crazy. Sweet! PH Lang Malakas!